Hi, welcome back to Engineer Your Space. I'm Isabel. Today I'm giving you a quick tour of my LA balcony and all the DIY projects that I did to make it a beautiful outdoor oasis. I can't wait to show you how it all came together, so let's get started. my balcony is only 35 square feet, I was determined to make the most out of it and not only have it be a place where I could lounge but also a place where I could eat and have a small garden. The makeover all started with covering up the walls. I made these wall caps to fit the top of the walls making that space usable for plants without having to worry about anything falling to the ground. To spruce up the dingy walls I used a reed fence to make panels that I screwed to the wood caps. I also wanted to create some privacy and have some shade, so I built lattice panels using inexpensive 1x2 furring strips. I had them cut at the hardware store, painted them, and then attached them together with decking screws. The front panel isn't very heavy at just over 30 pounds, but it is easier to handle with a helper. Now the tricky part was figuring out a way to install them without making any structural changes to the balcony or making any holes. My solution was to use sisal rope to attach the front panel to the existing columns and then use brackets, zip ties, and even getting creative with cabinet levelers to secure the side panels. The next part of the makeover were the finishing touches and I really wanted to make my small balcony feel like a cozy outdoor room. For the lounging area, I built a bench with 2x3s and 1x6 pine boards incorporating access to the storage space under the bench. Adding some cushions made it a perfect spot to lounge and it also serves triple duty as seating for the dining area. Here I used a small outdoor table from Ikea and gave it a makeover with a different finish on the base and a new top. For the garden I didn't have much space so I used the wall to hang an herb garden that I made with metal planters that I attached to a trellis. I added some more plants and some accessories to make it feel more cozy. And for lighting, I installed smart outdoor LED lights that I can turn on and off with my smartphone and change to any color that I want. It's just perfect for entertaining in the evening. Well, that's it for today's episode. I hope you've enjoyed my balcony transformation. And you can see more details on all my balcony projects in these videos here. And don't forget to use hashtag EYSinspire to share your projects. And you can also visit engineeryourspace.com to see other projects that people have done and more DIY ideas and tips. See you next time.